now uh, what is the percentage of the viewability uh, audience or coming to theaters and watching because you you know the exact number and figure how it is going i know that you are talking about the piracy which is actually affecting more of uh, not only in australia i think everywhere it is affecting yes with respect to australia you have a very good number definitely you know what kind of, yes. what, what is the how the people are watching and what what is you know making them interesting part and all yes. i think uh, like anywhere else in the world good films big films um, good stories small films are all working well at the box office um, and uh, dangal was the highest grossing um, uh, indian foreign film actually mm. uh, uh, this year mm. and uh, it took uh, 2.6 million at the australian box office which yep. is a huge number and um, so i feel that if a story is strong and human mm. uh, it does resonate and people right. keep coming back and the other good thing is our films have a lot of music strong music which also gives it a lot of repeat value where people want to come back and watch it on the big screen and uh, you know enjoy it and make it a family experience so um, uh, the good thing is that as far as percentage is concerned i would say almost 60% of the diaspora is going and watching films in theater buying ticket and watching films theater um i mean obviously i wish it was more yeah. and also i wish that uh, everybody didn't uh, watch it on their uh, set top boxes and so on yeah. but uh, having said that i think the true blue film lovers are still uh, going and watching films and also it's become very easy now that uh, everywhere we live we screen pretty much everywhere so it's very unlikely that uh, unless you're staying in the moon that you won't have a cinema near you that is screening um, indian films right